Hello. I'd like to talk today about preserving your wine barrel slash whiskey barrel planters. Uh, it's a great idea to pick up some half barrel, half wine barrels uh, slash whiskey barrels to use as planters um, because they look great as decorative uh, pieces throughout the yard. Um, <clears throat> what I've done here is drilled holes in them to allow for proper drainage. I used a uh, half inch hole saw and a two and a half inch hole saw. And then what I did also to preserve the actual wine barrel itself, because over time they will uh, fall apart if you, uh, if you don't take proper precautions to prevent that, I glued with a type two glue, outdoor glue, uh, all the way around the bottom, as you can see here. And inside, I actually took the time and glued and dropped some glue in, in the cracks to hold these uh, slats together because they will come apart if you're not careful. Um, and then eventually what I'll do with this barrel is I will polyurethane or you can use an outdoor paint. I use outdoor polyurethane. Uh, clear coat, it's just my preference. I polyurethane the bottom side of this because if it's going to sit on the ground, I put a couple coats on too, if it's going to sit on the ground it will eventually rot. Um, also I polyurethane the inside of these to allow um, a for extra added protection. Let's see, so main thing is to preserve these, if you're going to take the time to plant something and buy them, pick them up from the hardware store or wherever, your local winery, um, then take the time to actually uh, to preserve these and, and, and put uh, actual drainage holes in these, uh, glue them, so they last a lot longer. You know, these could last for many, many, many years. I've got a few more over here that I'm working on. And then I've got a raspberry shrub in here. Yep, that's going to work well. And also with these, let me show you a liner. I've, each one of these I've, I've done, I've put liners in. And actually I put two liners in, a set of two. So, <coughs> the first liner that goes in, you'll end up putting a bed of rocks on top of that liner. And then you put a second liner in, and then, of course, you put the soil in and then plant your plant. And then what I've done is, <clears throat> okay, like here, instead of cutting it, <clears throat> as you know, I don't know if I'm ever going to use these in the future, the liners, I, uh, I folded them in and I tucked them in and I pushed the dirt up against them. So um, that should work really well. Um, when they start blooming, they'll turn out really nice. We've got a few fruit trees here that eventually I'm going to plant um, somewhere throughout the yard and, and make use of them. Let's see what this one is. This is a peach tree. Yep, and you know the idea behind this is to make use of something, recycle a wine barrel, uh, you know, and turn your helping the environment and you're making something that will turn out really nice. Yeah, so stay tuned for the next videos. I'll actually be working on uh, gluing the slats for those wine barrels over there and <clears throat> polyurethaning the bottom side and the inside. Um, you could polyurethane the outside. It, I do use a clear coat outdoor polyurethane. Um, it'll darken the wood. But I kind of like the rustic look and I don't think it's going to make that big of a difference over time. Uh, I don't think it's going to degrade the wood as much uh, versus having the water sit inside I think is the uh, is the culprit of, of, of the wine barrel, wine slash whiskey barrels uh, you know, degrading and falling apart. So try to, you know, if you're going to take the time, like I said, to pick these up from your hardware store or local winery, take the time to preserve these properly. Drill the holes in them so your plants have proper drainage, so that the water doesn't sit there and rot out the wood inside. 
and or if you have the once you get the polyurethane you can also that'll help prevent rotting and um yep good luck and uh stay tuned for the next upcoming videos uh, on how to preserve wine barrels slash whiskey barrels and make beautiful decorative pieces throughout your yard